Hello and welcome to another video review. This one is a little bit different this time because I'm actually not going to be looking over a, uh, a Doctor Who toy for once. Uh, I'm going over something else that has piqued my interest over the past couple of months. I'm talking about Cards Against Humanity. Now just before Christmas I did pick up this set. This is the, uh, the core set, the Canadian edition, which you can see down here. Um, got it at a local retailer and as well I picked up the Cards Against Humanity first expansion. Now I did pay a little bit more for these because I got them local retail. Um, I'm big on supporting local and I love my local comic book shop and game stores and I know I did pay a little bit more but in the end hey it's going to a local business and I like that idea. But I wanted to get more of Cards Against Humanity because I knew it was out there. So I have the core set I have the first expansion. The only thing left to do over Christmas was I treated myself to ordering the rest. So the box that's actually behind here, and I'm going to lay the core set down, and well, I'll just leave that where it is. This box back here just arrived in the mail today, and you can see it goes on for quite a while. This contains, um, well it should contain, the second, third, fourth, fifth expansions the 90s nostalgia pack and to carry it all the bigger blacker box so I got a handy cu cutting tool around here somewhere I'm just gonna go ahead and I'll get this out of the way get that out of the way and I will oh my god <laughs> one end of this is so much heavier than the other so I will go ahead here and cut and I will cut more. <laughs> so this is just me actually right now on camera opening this. I just came in from taking this from the postman as he came into my driveway. And that's going to rip the rest of the way. And I'll just cut the end like so. And we got packing peanuts. We got biodegradable packing peanuts, which is going to ruin what I wanted to do for a reveal, I know, but what the heck. So, we can see all these nice packing peanuts. I'm going to reach over here first. I'm going to push the box back and keep that bent down, hopefully, to get rid of the shipping label. And we can see inside the way everything is stacked in here. Now that, ooh, you're not escaping packing peanuts. So, first up, pull out the 90s nostalgia pack. Awesome. Lay that down there for now. Packing peanuts. Uh, and they're actually put in here in order, yes. The second expansion is out. The third expansion fourth expansion, the fifth expansion, and I will pull back on this and get this centered up better in a minute. Push those packing peanuts down out of the way, because I don't want to make a big mess all over my floor. And lift out. lay that big box to the side and second third fourth fifth expansion the bigger blacker box the 90s nostalgia pack slide over we'll put the first expansion on here because they can all go in there the original. Can I get back far enough to get that in frame? I don't know. Let's take the 90s nostalgia pack, stand that up on the end. The original Cards Against Humanity is there. And I pull back, sorry for the handheld. And there is the complete, almost complete, Cards Against Humanity set. I know I am missing the 2012 and 2013 Christmas editions. I know I'm missing those. I will get those. 
I just kind of took some Christmas money and got all this and ran out of money. So, but I can't wait to see these. I, I, I love the first expansion. I love the Cards Against Humanity set. Let me see here. This is just me taking off plastic so I can do that off camera. But I'm going to do one hopefully on camera here because we all know the secret to the bigger blacker box. And I want to see if they're still doing it. We know the supposed secret to the bigger blacker box. I should say. Because I don't know if they are still doing it or not. And that's another reason I have my sharp little razor blade on hand is so that I can carefully extract what should be inside the bigger blacker box. Uh, if you hear the tearing of plastic, of course plastic is one of man's greatest enemies. From CD cases to cassette tapes. Kids, ask your, your parents what cassette tapes were to getting it off uh, vinyl records. The worst was CD labels, I think. But getting it off decks of cards probably ranks a close second here. That's the fourth. The fifth. Now, what kills me the most here is as I'm opening this, um, to open the 90s nostalgia pack, I gotta carefully try it or else I'm gonna destroy that packaging. And I don't really wanna destroy the package. Get off of there. That's the fifth unwrapped. And, see, if I bring in the 90s nostalgia pack, you can see. Um, it's a really nice pack. It, like, it's an old school package. It's like opening uh, trading cards. It's like opening hockey cards. And I like that package. And yes, there's a tear option here, but I don't want to tear this really. Uh, hmm. How am I going to do this? He asks himself quizzically. Hmm. Maybe I'll put along the back seam. Carefully cut into the front and get an uneven line. Haha. -ha. There, cut it unevenly and nicely, and everything just slides right out. <laughs> well, that, yeah. Sunny D, all right. <laughs> Perfect. So we see it's the 90, I mean, we have the Great Cornholio, yelling girl power and doing a high kick. Where did I see it? Pamela Anderson's boobs running in slow motion. So we do have a good variety of 90s nostalgia in there. Song lyric. How did Stella get her groove back? It's Morphin time! Sweet! So I'm gonna love the 90s nostalgia pack. So we got our white cards and our black cards in there. And I did it without completely destroying the package in opening it. So I should be able to slip the cards back in for if I take the 90s nostalgia pack out of my deck. Sweet! Now, do I wanna go to the expansions? It's just it's Cards Against Humanity. We know what Cards Against Humanity is. Uh, I don't think I can go search the first expansion. I'm not even sure if it's here. I, know, I recently played a game, so I don't know where this is here. Uh, where the card I'm looking for, because we know the gag. We know what the crowd at Cards Against Humanity did. Where they found out quickly when they packaged the, ga the game that they put it in alphabetical order and the very first card you got from the first expansion is what I'm looking for right now. And you can he probably hear me shuffling through the cards here. How come I can't find it? It's probably going to be at the very end of this here. Uh, yes. 
when you open up Cards Against Humanity, the first expansion, the very first card you see, yeah, that's it. Alphabetically, that's what you get. So they kind of continued it, and I say kind of because it was originally unintentional, but then they just ran with the gag. So when you open the second expansion, shift everybody down here, it should be Yeah, there it is. It's the very first thing you find. Because, you know, what else would you expect to find opening up a box? And there's some blank black and white cards at the back. But, when you continue on through the sets, you would think the gag would keep going in the third set, but oh no. They didn't do that. You open up the third set of cards. <laughs> you have something I'm really not putting on camera. Oh god. But, the third, fourth, and fifth, none of them continued the gag from the first and second, so we didn't really know what to think and what was going on. But, that brings us to the bigger, blacker box. Now, where is my trusty opening apparatus here? Also known as a razor blade. The plastic has been cut. So. It actually peels off pretty easily. Because why wouldn't it? And I get rid of that plastic. And we have the matte finish on the bigger blacker box because that's what it is, is the big storage box and we see Cards Against Humanity. On the bottom actually is really nice because it looks like a, uh, a collage here from other Cards Against Humanity cards. But, let's see. I will lay it down. And it takes a second to open. And inside we have a divider, we have the included foam block dividers, just to give you more room. And what I love about these is one of them on the end, if I can get it out, that's what she said. Um, there we go, is the Cards Against Humanity Foam block nutritional facts. Feel free to read them, because yeah. It has 0% of anything, not a significant source of dietary fiber, sugars, potassium, vitamin D, niacin, iron, magnesium, folate, or vitamin E. Percent daily values are based on 2,000 calorie diet. Ingredients, ethylene, vinyl, acetate. Good enough. So there's five of these blocks, but that's the only one with nutritional information on it. They're just there to divide because you have all this room in the big black box, the bigger blacker box. And we have 10 dividers, and we have some blank uh, white and black cards that you can write on to make your own fun. And we have the Cards Against Humanity box expansion with the instructions, do not use. So, okay, I probably won't, but we'll see, because I know what's in there. But, you have that. Now, what Cards Against Humanity did to carry on the gag, I'm going to lay the, bo the bottom of this aside. I am now checking the bigger blacker box. Because you see, this here was a false lit. Ah! There it is. I can feel it, it from here to here. This is a false lid completely. I mean, actually, you can even see... I think you can see, there it is, there's a bit of paper right in there. So, hmm. this is basically a false top, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this in on camera, what I'm going to do to this, but I'm going to try and be as careful as I can, and I might just, I might just rip the whole thing out after, but I'm going to try and be careful here for now.
and it's going sort of well. I have irreparably cut into the box. I don't know how well you can see, or if you can see the slit that I have made. But I have cut in far enough now that I've cut right over. And I can get my finger in there now. I'm going to see if I can get this out. Uh, I need another card. Hmm. Or maybe that'll work. I don't know if I'm going to be careful, or I'm just going to rip the whole bleeding thing out. I'm just going to rip the whole bleeding thing out, because that whole piece of paper you can take out, and there's the secret. There is one more card. So we had a big one, we had a bigger blacker one, and then we have... Yep. Embossed in in silver, the ultimate card to put into your deck. Hidden in the lid for the bigger blacker box. So, yeah, I got a big tear. But that whole piece of paper is just glued in. And it'll emboss and clean up. But, except for the gash I put in the top, I'm going to need to do a little bit more clean up in there, but that piece of paper rips out and it can rip out pretty cleanly and I just go in and scrape down a little more. So, there you have it. I have. The bigger, blacker box from Guards Against Humanity. And I have the first, second, third, fourth, fifth expansions. I have, of course, the core game because you need Guards Against Humanity to play any of this, and the 90's Nostalgia Pack. So I am truly a horrible, horrible person. Thanks for watching.